What's up you guys, it's Graham here. So unfortunately we got a little bit of bad news and that is that T-Series is catching up to PewDiePie. So we need to make sure number one, everyone is subscribed to PewDiePie. Number two, everyone needs to unsubscribe from T-Series. Let's get into the video. So ever wonder what the best way is to double your money, whether you have $100, $1,000, $100,000, or one million dollars. <clears throat> So I'm gonna be showing you exactly how to do this and this works on any amount of money, except if you have zero dollars because you can't double nothing. Now here's exactly what you do step by step. Step number one is you take your money, this. Step number two is you fold it in half like so and then there you go. You've doubled your money. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not, I'm not gonna be a comedian anytime soon. But for real though, let's break this down and talk about how you can actually double your money and exactly what's involved in doing so. And the best part about this is that these strategies are historically proven to work as long as you're willing just to put in the time and understand exactly what you're doing. And also, if you put in the time to smash that like button if you haven't already. So when it comes to doubling your money, here's how it works. In order to successfully do this, you need to put your money to work for you by investing it. There's pretty much no other way around this. You cannot double your money if you simply put it in a savings account or under your mattress or in BitConnect. What am I gonna do? I mean, you could always just go to Vegas and put all of your money on black, but you know what? I'm gonna save that for another video. So that then leads us to the question. Graham, what is the best investment that I can make to double my money? What's the best way to do this? And that loyal YouTube viewer who is preferably subscribed and who is preferably smashed that like button already, that is a very good question. And your answer to that question really comes down to one of two choices. Number one, do you have time? Number two, are you okay with risk? Your decision when it comes to those two options are best going to determine how to invest your money and how you can most effectively double it. Now the reality is if you don't have any time whatsoever and you don't care how high risk it is, you just want a chance at doubling it, chances are your best option is just to go to Vegas and put it all on the roulette table. Oh, yes! <laughs> at that point, you pretty much have a 50-50 chance at doubling your money with just a few seconds of work. But on the other hand, if you have some time and don't want to risk losing all of your money in a matter of seconds, you need to be more strategic with what you invest in. And that is exactly what this video is meant for. And that, ladies and gentlemen, takes us to the risk time quadrant. Now, this might seem pretty basic, but all investments fall within one of these four categories. You have high risk, high return, high risk, low return, low risk, high return, and low risk, low return, and then BitConnect falls somewhere just totally off of that quadrant. Given that, the first thing that you need to consider is how much risk are you willing to take to try to double your money? Would you be okay with losing some or all of your money in an effort to double it as fast as you possibly can? Or do you have all the time in the world to reasonably guarantee that your money will double at some point in the future? So let's cover all of these scenarios and I'll throw in a few different concepts that you can use. First of all, if you want a very safe way to double your money because you have time, it's almost as simple as just compound interest and then waiting. This strategy has worked since the beginning of time and will continue to work until it doesn't. And this is also what's called the rule of 72. And if you haven't heard of this before, you need to know exactly what this is because it's insanely important when it comes to doubling your money. The rule of 72 is pretty much a very easy calculation to determine how long it's going to take to double your money. You simply divide 72 by the expected return of whatever your investment is, and that answer is how many years it's going to take to double your money. For example, if you're getting a 5% return on your money, you simply take 72, divide that by five, and that is how many years it's going to take you to double your money, and that's 14. And at that rate, that money continues to double every 14 years. So it might take you 14 years to go from 100 to $200, then 14 years later to go from two to $400, then 14 years later to go from four to $800, and so on and so on and so on every single 14 years. And that same math works whether you're getting a 2% return, 4% return, 8% return, 20% return, whatever it is, Divide 72 by that and that's how many years it's going to take you to double your money. Now some people now in the comments are probably gonna get a little bit triggered because they're gonna get angry because they say something like, but Graham, I could die tomorrow. How do I double my money really, really fast? 
dislike unsubbed. But you know what? That's a great question and I totally get it. Not everyone has the luxury of time to wait and take this slow and steady approach. Some people just want to make some pretty big moves in style and try to double their money as quickly as possible. So here's a few options that you can use as well. Now, if you want to achieve a return higher than what the market generates on average per year, which is somewhere between seven and 9%. And again, in this situation, that would take you seven to 10 years to double your money. You need to either make riskier investments or put in the work to compensate you for a higher return. And there's pretty much no other way around this. There's no way for you to get a higher return without one of these factors coming into play. And for anyone else who tells you otherwise that you can get some insane return for no risk, no time, or no work, I think they're pretty much just lying to you. So with that said, if you're the type of person who's okay with making some riskier moves to try to get a higher return, you might want to look into speculating cryptocurrencies, Forex, penny stocks, individual stocks, swing trading, or anything else like this that is a lot riskier, but on the other hand, you can get some much higher returns. And as far as doubling your money goes, if you average a 20% return on your money every single month, it's only going to take you four months or so to double your initial investment. And some of those investments actually have the potential to double your money within a few hours or sometimes even days. But just remember that it's very easy to lose just as much money as you gain. There's a reason why these are so risky and if they were that easy for everyone to double or triple their money within a few months, everyone would be doing it. But if you're good at what you do and you fully understand it and you're willing to put in the time and work it takes to do it, by all means, you can get some pretty substantial returns. But the one thing I've noticed with people who do stuff like that and they do it very well and they make a lot of money is that at some point in the future when they've accumulated enough money, they eventually tend to move out of the high risk, high reward category into something that's a lot lower risk, lower return because they don't need to take on any more unnecessary risk. So again, if you decide to go for this, just understand that if you're gonna get a high your return, you need to put in more work, you need to put in more time, and you need to be more educated on what you're doing so you don't lose money. Now for everyone else who's watched to this point and hasn't yet gotten triggered, now is probably going to be the point where you're going to get maybe a little bit upset and say something like, but Graham, I don't want to wait 10 years to double my money, and also I don't want to risk losing it all by trading cryptocurrencies on margin. What do I do? Well then, I have the perfect answer for you. But because you want your money sooner and you're not willing to take the risk to do that, you need to compensate for that by working for that return instead. If you're willing to do a lot of the work yourself, you can pretty much reap all the benefits of doubling your money in a short amount of time without taking on a ton of risk and without going to Vegas and just putting it all on black. For example, if you have a few thousand dollars and you just wanna double it as fast as you possibly can, consider flipping items on Craigslist or eBay. Reselling iPhones, electronics, game consoles, designer clothes, shoes, anything like this is a great way to potentially double your money in a matter of days or weeks with very low risk. I actually used to work with someone who would make an extra thousand dollars a week by going to Goodwill on the weekends, buying designer clothing, getting it cleaned up, listing it on eBay, and then shipping it out during the week on her lunch break. Within a few weeks, she can easily turn a thousand dollar investment into two or three thousand dollars very quickly with almost no risk. And also, if you have the money, the income, the credit, and the time to learn the business, I've seen many real estate investments where you can double your money in a matter of three to six months. And this is something I have done with almost every single property that I bought, and this is how I've been able to make most of my net worth is through real estate. On the last duplex I purchased, my $225,000 investment turned into $465,000 worth of equity in just over four months. And on the property I bought before that, my $175,000 investment turned into $520,000 within just two years. And even if the market didn't go up during this time frame, I would still be looking at a 50 to 100% return on my investment within really just a few months after buying the property. However, this takes a substantial amount of work time and area expertise to ensure that you don't lose money in the process of doing that. These were deals that I was able to get slightly under market value. I was then able to go in and renovate the property to add even more equity. And by that time, I was able to double my initial investment in really just a matter of a few months. From there, I could either do a cash out refinance to pull out all of that profit completely tax free, or I could just leave it in the deal in the form of equity and then leverage that later on. And none of these are flips either. These are all deals that I've always bought 
never sold, always plan to keep them, and I simply rent them out long term. But this is by no means anything that was passive. I spent a substantial amount of time finding and renovating these deals so that I could go and double my money that quickly. This was by no means something that was just passive that you can just go and like buy one of these every few weeks and get them done and like continue to double your money. It doesn't really work like that. But other options here besides in real estate might be starting up a business. Maybe you have $5,000 and you use that as an investment to start up a Shopify store that might generate you $10,000 six months from now in profit. Or maybe you end up investing the money into starting a YouTube channel of your own and you can invest some money in a good camera, lighting equipment, audio equipment, and a dinosaur skull to then start making you money in the future once you start enabling monetization and start getting a lot of views. So if you plan to go that route, you can absolutely find a lot of great ways to double your investment within a year as long as you're willing to do a lot of the work yourself. But you have to be prepared to actually work for it because that is the only factor that will replace risk in terms of getting a very high return. And finally, another option I've seen many people do when it comes to getting a high return on their money is what's called hard money lending. This means that you become the lender and you lend your money to other people to complete whatever projects they need, which is typically in business or real estate. For example, maybe you lend $50,000 to a real estate developer for six months at a 10% return. And typically when you do this, in return for lending your money, you get a lien on the property or whatever assets the lender has. So that way, if they don't end up paying you or they default on that, you can go after their assets and get your money back. Now, I've dabbled in this a little bit before with some pretty good results, and you definitely just need to know what you're doing and know the projects that will actually go and make money to invest in, and you have to be pretty sure you're going to get paid your money back so you don't have to go and like fight to, to foreclose on assets or anything like that. But if you do it correctly, again, hard money lending can end up paying very well. But remember though, anytime someone tells you about something that gives you a very high return and they say it's low risk or it just sounds too good to be true, like BitConnect, just don't listen to it. That doesn't exist. In order to actually double your money, it's either with time, risk, or work. If it doesn't fit within one of those three, it doesn't exist or it's a scam. Now my perfect choice between them is time and work. I don't like to take a lot of risk with my money financially. I don't like to lose money. So because of that, I would rather take a slow and steady approach and at the same time, do the work I need to to make sure I get the return I want. And that's what I recommend for everyone watching. And if you have the risk tolerance to be riskier with your money and potentially lose it, by all means, go and do that. But there is no magic pill when it comes to doubling your money. There is no safe way to absolutely do it without putting in time, risk, or work. And so with that said, that is how you can most effectively double your money as fast as you possibly feel comfortable with in the safest way possible with the least amount of work possible. That is how it's actually done. And with that said, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you made it to the very end, you haven't already subscribed, make sure to smash that subscribe button, smash that notification bell so YouTube notifies you anytime I post a video, which is three times a week. So smash that notification bell, be a part of the notification squad. Also feel free to add me on Snapchat and Instagram. I post it pretty much daily, so if you wanna be a part of it there, feel free to add me there. Thank you again for watching, and also make sure to subscribe to PewDiePie and unsubscribe from T-Series. Thank you for watching. Till next time.